hey loves welcome back again to my channel in today's video i'll be showing you the easy way to make homemade mayonnaise with a few ingredients so keep on watching all our ingredients have been pre-measured and for this recipe you need two eggs you need one cup of oil you need about a tablespoon of lemon juice you need half teaspoon of salt and half teaspoon of sugar and you also need your hand mixer and your mixing bowl so the first thing i did was to separate my egg whites from my egg yolks and you want to go ahead and start mixing your egg yolks so you mix this for about a minute or less actually and then you introduce your oil so the oil you have to pour it gradually don't stop mixing pour your oil after a few seconds you pour another oil but you have to continuously mix this okay so that's what we're doing right now you just want to continue doing that you pour your oil while mixing you wait a little while while mixing but don't stop your mixer just keep on mixing it comes together pretty fast i mean in less than in less than seven minutes you should be done you know making this with your hand mixer i like to mix everything before adding in my salt my sugar and my lemon juice i don't want to you know break up the process so i'll just continue doing this you can see that i'm adding my oil while i'm mixing and allowing it to incorporate before adding you know another batch of the oil and this is how you want to continue adding your oil till you've added half cup of the oil that's the first step if you can't find lemon around you or you don't have lemon juice you can also make use of vinegar but then i prefer lemon juice you don't need too much and that's why i like to add it at the end so that you don't add too much of the lemon juice or even the salt and i really like to add a little bit of sugar not too much but just a little bit to balance out the taste now we have mixed it to this stage we only used half cup of oil you can stop at this stage with half cup of oil or you can go further by adding the remaining half cup of oil if you want to stop at this stage say for instance you don't want it to be too thick just add your salt adding your lemon juice a little bit of lemon juice your salt and your sugar but the sugar is optional but if you want to continue like i'm doing right now then go ahead and add in more oil add the oil and mix add the oil and mix we're almost there i only added a quarter cup more of oil i'll show you what the consistency looks like now compared to you know when we added just half cup of oil like i said earlier if you're satisfied with the way it is go ahead and add in your salt your sugar i mean just a little bit and your lemon juice so now we're going to add in our salt we still have some more oil and i'm going to show you what it will look like if you add in more oil i'm adding in my sugar and i'm adding in my lemon juice and that was a teaspoon of lemon juice so we're going to mix this again for just a few more minutes and i'll show you what it looks like if you're still watching this video thank you so much for your support please give this video a massive thumbs up like this video and let me know in the comment section if you've ever made mayonnaise at home what do you think about you know the store-bought mayonnaise compared to homemade mayonnaise let's talk about it in the comment section if you're based abroad you can find pasteurized eggs once you use pasteurized eggs you know that your your mayonnaise is free from salmonella but if you are you live in nigeria or in a country where you cannot find pasteurized eggs don't worry at all the lemon juice in this recipe is going to you know kill the bacteria in the mayonnaise so you are safe and you don't have anything to worry about and you can also taste your mayonnaise in case you know it's not tasting good enough you can add a little bit more lemon juice to balance out the taste so i'm going to add a little bit more lemon juice about half teaspoon to one teaspoon so the total amount of lemon juice used for this recipe is about two teaspoons
now we've added in the whole one cup of oil and we are done mixing i'm going to turn off the mixer right now and show you what the consistency looks like so this is how thick the mayonnaise looks at this point now note that once you keep this mayonnaise whether you keep it on the tabletop for about 30 minutes 10 minutes 20 minutes or even one hour it will get thicker so if you do not want it to be this thick use less oil our creamy mayonnaise is ready and this is what the texture looks like i mean just take a look at that let me know what you think about this creamy mayonnaise in the comment section i really love to read from you remember to give this video a thumbs up subscribe turn on your post notification so you'll be the first to know when next i upload and i'll see you in my next video stay blessed and stay happy bye